Greetings, fellow flu heroes. Welcome to the mission briefing. What's the target? Flu. A nasty little bug that can give you a bad temperature, bad coughs, and bad sneezes. It can spread easily, but you can fight it. My name is Mark Gregg. I'm a registered mental health nurse, and I love my job at LPT because I work with an incredible staff team across the Bradford Mental Health Unit who go beyond the call of duty every single day to improve the lives of patients with people who suffer from mental health problems and it makes me proud to work with them. I couldn't put it into one word because there's just too many good things about it. Like honestly, this college has made such a difference to my life. I mean it's given me confidence and it's given me a positive outlook to the future. It's given me tips to stay well. I just, I love coming here. It means so much to me. I love the people here. It's just amazing. I can't sum it up in one word. <laughs> yeah, I did, yeah. Good. Ruth and her carer have now finished watching the film about breast screening. Ruth talks again to her carer. Ruth has learned lots about breast screening and having a mammogram. She has looked at leaflets, watched a DVD and visited her local breast screening unit. Ruth then decides she wants to go to her breast screening appointment. As Imran's speech and language therapist, I'm working together with his carers and his family to put together a communication passport. And this is a document that has all that information about how Imran communicates, how people need to communicate with him, how they can spend time together and have fun with him. Um, and so that all that information is in one place that can go to new places, be given to new people who meet him so that everyone knows that information and doesn't have to start finding it out from the beginning again. Boys are asking for health advice in Leicester. Now they can text their school nurse. Uh, it's got a password and stuff, so it's very private, and you can talk about something that you might not want to talk about face to face necessarily. It allows us to express ourselves in a way that we couldn't express to our friends, and to know that it's confidential makes me makes me open up to other people besides my other friends. Partnership with the CCG to develop new out of hospital services. So, for example, we've developed an intensive community support service, 48 virtual beds provided in people's homes to enable people to be cared for by district nurses and physiotherapists for more intensive rehabilitation in their own homes. My name's Dana. Um, I'm a community nurse. I love my job. I love going out and seeing patients um, and looking after them. And sometimes I'm the only person that, that patient will see in a day. And when I leave, I know that I'm leave, leaving that patient with a lovely, happy smile on their face. We've also developed a new night assessment service. And so since September, this has prevented 142 people from being admitted into hospital because we've been able to look after them at night in their own homes. My name is Maggie and I, I thoroughly enjoy being, being a nurse and I love the role in the community, having the pleasure of looking after people in their own homes. It gives you a tiny dose of virus that's been weakened to stop it making you ill. It'll power up your immune system to fight flu viruses, which makes your body a little bit more awesome. Yeah, science! I love nursing because every day is different and it gives me the opportunity to meet lots of different people and care for them in a way I want to be cared for. Um, the area that we serve has quite a high level of obesity and other factors that are, account for health reasons, so that was another part of why we decided to get involved in the project and put it to the Student Council. I like the website because um, it will make you fit and I like the characters. I don't know what you've been told, I don't know what you've been told, saying health is the way to go, saying health is the way to go, eat, drink, be, hope you exercise, exercise.